the opinion. That's it. I think I gotta go though. Okay, okay. thanks. Let's see ya. Okay. So, uh, how do you feel about people eating animals? Well, I think that uh, if animals were meant to be eaten, they'd grow on trees. Really? Yeah. Okay. How about uh, equal pay for equal work for animals? How do you feel about that? I think they should get more pay, actually. They do harder work than we do and they get nothing, you know, no recognition. Right. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. How about, you know, like uh, on buses? Animals aren't allowed to, to go on buses now or vote. Uh, you know, what, what would you do about that? I would give uh, definitely give animals the, the right to vote. I think yeah. that because they work so hard, they should be able to elect government officials. Mm -hmm. uh, as for riding on buses, uh, we may have to put some facilities in in case they you know, yeah. <laughs> need to use the facilities. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see. Well, thank you for your time. Anytime. Okay. Pleasure. <laughs> We're rolling. Yeah. We're rolling. Yeah. Okay. So, how do you feel about animal rights? Excellent idea. Yeah. Yep. Equal work. Equal pay. Correct. A dollar a foot. Dollar a foot. What about a fin? A fin, okay. How about um, riding on buses? They're not riding in buses or even um, voting. Think they should be allowed to vote? I think they should. Yeah? I certainly think they should. Okay. I think there's no reason for anybody not to be able to vote except the Queen. The Queen's not allowed to vote. I don't see any reason why the fish should be in the same category. Okay, I see. Um, how, about, how about using them for research? The Queen? Animals. Oh, the animals. If they want to, if they have equal rights, they should have the opportunity. Mm -hmm. I see. Can you do the bit again about the Queen with the buzzer got it? I can't remember what it was. I asked you, uh, do you think, uh, how about research? Oh, I said what, for the Queen? Yeah. Okay, I'll ask you. Yeah. What about using them for research? The Queen? No, no, animals. Oh, no, well, look, I think the equal rights have the opportunity to be able to be researched if they like. Mm. I see. Oh, thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. Great what am I going to look like on CBC tomorrow night at news time? No, it's not CBC, it's CBW, Channel 11. Okay, so how do you feel about animal rights? I feel animal rights is highly overrated. I am much more concerned about human rights. Human rights. Well, don't you think it'll be alumni rights? Right. Don't you people go out there and it's a dog's world? What about? I don't think dogs should be treated that way. Right. Do you feel that they should get equal pay for equal work? Uh, if they put in overtime, absolutely. Mm -hmm. No, only if they put in overtime, though. Definitely. Right. Okay. What about uh, letting them go on buses or voting? Uh, as of now, they're not allowed to vote. Well, as long as they're bus trained, purely bus trained, mm -hmm. and don't take more than one transfer, I think they should be allowed on buses. And, and voting? Um, if they can make an X, absolutely. Mm -hmm. I see. Okay. Thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. So tell me, how do you feel about uh, animals being used in research? Uh, no comment. Uh, animal rights, don't you feel they should have some rights? Uh, that sort of thing? Uh, no, no comment. No comment. I see. Um, what about eating of animals? They're, they're slaughtered in that? Well, no comment. No comment. Okay, thank you very much. No comment. <laughs> uh, the took is gone. We had a big clean up here because they're going to paint the walls. Breakfast. <laughs> Put one of them in a bun. Put it in a bun. Bacon sandwich. We're here speaking with a renowned scientist who has agreed to give us information on examples of experiments going on using animals provided that we retain his anonymity. He will now expound on this point. Now, many experiments can be done without animals. Mm -hmm. uh, I know a company, for example, in uh, Winnipeg that was like testing for new uh, soft drinks. Oh yeah. And they used uh, Thompson's gazelles. Yeah. Oh yeah, many gazelles. Uh, so like uh, maybe 93. 93? 93, yes. Uh, there was a company, uh, I, I had something to do oh, with... Oh, 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 oh. It was a taste test, right? They weren't like testing for toxicity or anything, so okay. So Joe asked him, uh, was it... Uh, okay, what, what, type, what, what kind of experiments were they doing with the Thompson gazelles? Oh, no, I suppose. <laughs> taste test. <laughs> Okay, what's more? What's oh, more? What kind of what kind ready? Ready? Joe, what's okay. more? Yeah, he's right. What sort of experiments were they doing with these Thompson Oh, gazelles? they're doing a taste test. Taste test yeah. for soft drinks. Yeah, they're taste, yeah, that's oh. right. Yeah. These gazelles were, were actually drinking these soft drinks. I see. And uh, they, they liked it. Oh, that's... It wasn't too bad. Do you, have, do you have any other examples? Well, sometimes, you know, you get dogs, you know. But dogs, they don't like Pepsis or Coca-Colas and stuff like that. Yeah. They like uh, root beer. Oh, I dogs like root beer. Yeah, they like root beer. Okay. What about other experiments that you know of where they used animals? With animals? 
as well. Like I know a shirt factory, you know. Yeah. They dressed up pigs. Pigs. In shirts and they just to see how they look. Were they, were they using natural fibers or synthetic fibers? Well, the the pigs didn't like synthetic fibers, so they have to use natural they fibers. They use natural fiber natural shirts fibers, on the pigs. Yeah, yeah I see. Mm. Okay. And uh, also I know some experiments where they're testing like for uh, like for dishwashing liquid. Yeah. You know? What did they and, have? Oh, and just to see how fast the suds went up, you know? Yeah, what did, what were they, what did they use the animal for there? What animal were they talking about? A weasel. They had a weasel. Did they? Let's see. Next to the sink. They were, they were yeah, they, making suds and then they had a weasel in the cage. They're, they're making suds in the sink. And then the the next to the sink. They were suds up next to the sink. They had a weasel in the cage. And they were hitting it with a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> Are you still ready? Yeah, 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 we're yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, what do you want me to start? Um, can you just start talking about it? Just say there was a company, they were testing dishwashing Oh yeah, there was a company, you know, they were testing uh, dishwashing liquid and uh, to see how fast the sun would go up. Mm -hmm. And uh, next to the sink, they had a weasel, mm -hmm. uh, like sort of in a cage. Yeah. And then they were hitting it with a hammer. The cage or the weasel? Well, both. <laughs> I see. Oh, and, and what did this have to do with the suds? Well, anyway, when they hit the weasel, yeah. the such seemed to just multiply. Oh, really? Very good. It was a very good experiment. Uh -huh. One of our best, actually. Yeah? Mm, I see. Well, thank you for your time. Uh, oh, you're welcome. Anytime. Okay.